After publishing the first video about how to build an acoustic visualizer, which is simply a laser reflecting off of a small piece of mirror mounted on a thin rubber membrane stretched over a 5 inch cylinder and then reflecting onto a wall, I realized I had forgotten to give some of the best frequency combinations to produce the best images. Now every visualizer is going to be different, so they're going to respond differently, but these should give you some ideas of what to look for. All of the traces in this video require a two oscillator tone generator. Here's the one I like. Oscillator A will be the first frequency cited, oscillator B the second. This first trace is simple, but I like it because it reminds me of the opening credits to the 1958 cult classic, The Blob, starring Steve McQueen. Oops, I think I just dated myself. This one's a little more interesting. This one's even better. What I like about this one is that the intersection where a lot of the lines bunch together oscillates between the bottom and the top and back again. The shape of the pattern isn't determined by only the relative frequencies of the two oscillators, but also the relative volumes. In this case, I'm decreasing the volume of oscillator B, and then increasing it again, so you can see how that affects the image. This is one of my favorites. I love the way it undulates. Focusing on the tips of one of the loops and then following it as the image progresses shows how the image evolves. Some frequency combinations produce patterns like this one that are long and slender. Others, like the previous one, are short and wide. And here's one more that's just fun. I hope you enjoyed this video and that you'll stop by my main website, waynesthisandthat.com, for hundreds of other similar topics. Thanks for watching.